officially ready to start a new game. Feels like we just did this like three streams ago. But hey, I'm excited to do this one. Um, I've been hurt a few times by this um, series, but I'm ready to be hurt again. <laughs> and I'm, by hurt, I mean I just get really mad about how much money I pay for it and how short it is. But I get it. It's, you got to give and take. The production quality is very, very high with these games. Um, I would just get very annoyed at how short they were, but um, I'm ready to play the next one. So hopefully, uh, I don't remember if this one came out after, um, is it, was it Man and Madame? <gasps> Fuck. Oh my God. <laughs> Jeez. Gamer, good evening. Cheers. Ooh. Subtle yet so powerful when that hits, right? <laughs> Thank you for the jump scare. I hope you're doing well, my friend. Oh, God. Forgiving. Hang on. Survival is expected. Your skills will be tested. Death, okay. We'll, we'll go medium grade. Oh, I don't know if I did that right. I can't remember if this came out right after Man and Medan or what the order was. Some decisions save lives. Mine up. You're way behind. Okay, refresh, gamer. The wheel is 264 feet, Jeff. Can you imagine it? I'm attempting to. I bet you can. Oh, please. I can't hear anything, so I need subtitles. Fuck. Oh my god. <laughs> Gamer. Aw, oh, there we go. <laughs> you got the jump scare real time. <laughs> Cheers, my friend. Oof. It's only been a week since I've streamed, but those are hitting hard tonight. Gamer, how was your weekend? Whatever pleases you the most. You please me the most. 1893. Not weary of me after an entire day of marriage. I will never be weary of you. I shall hold you to that, my dear. Oh, they are newlyweds for sure. I'm doing well, thank you. I'm excited to play a new game. I'm gonna turn the Elgato up just a tiny, tiny bit. Isn't this grand? As advertised. Very nice. Now this shit's haunted. Is fantabulous, lovely. I'd love to hear that. What did I do this weekend? Are we the only ones here? I'm sure there was a mad dash first thing this morning to get to the fair. What did I do this week? Oh, I went home to visit my parents. <laughs> that was fun. Got some good sleep in. I feel like I could use like another. 20 hours of sleep, though. Well, this does not bode well for the level of service we're in store for. Oh, I have to move my drink. 
Oh god, oh, wait, what? Okay, I was using the wrong joystick. That's no way to run a business. Slow service. That means they're making sure everything is perfect. That's my Marie. Okay, Always can I use the right joystick, apparently. You don't, you don't get sleep. I don't, I don't get sleep in general, so I'm sure you have it much worse than I do, though. Startling, and for making you wait. My attention was needed elsewhere. Four a.m. I promise, from here on out, it will be nothing but silver linings. Jeez, four a.m. That's insane. I didn't realize they had Welcome to get there that early. To the World's Fair Hotel. Please, sign in here. First time in Chicago? I'm going to hazard a guess and assume you're here to take in the exposition. The fair, yes. The hell's an exposition? Today is a very special day for us. Oh, the honeymoon. How Jeff, very, hello, very how are you? Lovely. Perhaps my wife, Mrs. Whitman, would like to sign. Why, why is this yes. so awkward? Today's the beginning of our honeymoon. Congratulations. I, I don't know how to sign things. In that case, an upgrade is in order. A honeymoon suite. <sighs> I'm sorry, it's my first time signing my well, name. Uh, there we go. <laughs> that much higher? <laughs> I think nothing of it. Same rates as your regular room. The upgrade is on us. You're our first honeymooners. How kind. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. Henry Howard Holmes. No, don't you instantly don't trust them with the same well, thank you very much. initials across the board. And built most of it myself. You're an architect then? Architect, designer, builder. Doctor, artist, I'm a man of many interests. Impressive. Please have a look around. We have sundries and gifts at the pharmacy counter. I'll take your luggage up to your room and ensure that everything is in order. In order Just for your death. If you decide to purchase anything, and we will add it to your bill. Yeah, four four is uh, the store opens at four thirty. Who is up at that early Thank drinking you, Mr. coffee? Holmes. We appreciate it. The pleasure is all mine. Jeff, I'm doing well. I'm excited to start a new game. So we'll see how this one goes. I've been wanting to play the Man and Dan ones for a while. I was waiting for them to go on sale because I have feelings about their cost versus length. Just, just, just pocket it. Oh, I didn't, oh, I actually did not mean to do that. <laughs> I didn't, okay, well, oh, that's the direction we're going with. Pardon me, miss. Careful, you. My husband gets awfully cross with men who act fresh. Hmm, it sounds like a ripe fellow. How's the marriage going? Lovely. I think I just decided somebody's death by stealing a box of face powder. I'm sure the room is ready. See anything good over there at the jewelry counter? Anything fancy? Wouldn't you like to know? Well, b balls, I wanted to look around a little bit. Wonder what's in here. I'm starting to think I've gone and married a thrill seeker. Not sure if anybody's seen Sorry, this one yet. Forbidden rooms. Are we looking for excitement? Perhaps. <sighs> Nothing but an unfinished room. See what happens when you chase a thrill? If this is you trying to get out of the Ferris wheel. I know you won't be denied. 
Wait. What's that? Oh god, they're totally gonna die. I can't wait. They're annoying already. I want them to die, like, soon. Press A. Button may change to what? <laughs> I hate quick time shit. I overthink it. I did it. I did it. <laughs> I made it. That was a thrill. You won't think it's thrilling if we're sleeping on the street after getting kicked out of here. Let's go. Oh, he's gonna bust us. hell welcome newlyweds to the honeymoon suite <laughs> it's actually really nice thank you kindly mr. Holmes do enjoy your stay if you'll excuse me I have work to return to I'm sure we'll see each other again soon Okay, that's like that's when I'm like, no, we're officially gonna <laughs> dip out of here. This guy's this guy's low key gonna kill us. Fit for a king. Or my queen. Oh you. Kiss this. That is not very wifely of you. He just drills the back of her head as she gets knocked out. <laughs> you asked. Just do it, do Should it, dude. Like, just, just knock her out. <laughs> mercy, mercy. Okay, this is the win. most, like, tame quick time Anything thing I've ever done in my life. Only my pride. How about a peace offering? Hmm. This feels like some sort of treacherous plot. Not at all. I have a gift for you. I swear to God, if he says it's his dick, <laughs> we're turning it off. Close your eyes. Face the mirror. Aren't you clever and romantic? If I get a pillow to the face, I will sock you right in the kisser. <laughs> Is there a problem? No. Open your eyes. Oh, Jeff, it's lovely. I love it. Good. Victory is mine. I'll let you have that bath now. Oh, how, how do you not notice that? I mean, obviously, they're zooming into it now, but like a little white clear circle on the side of the mirror. Yeah, that's pretty, pretty obvious there. What is she trying to do? It's jammed shut. Maybe if we put a little weight into it? Uh. Uh. Open sesame! <laughs> Thank you. Why don't you have a shave while I take a quick bath? Then we can reconvene. I know that word. It's French for something illicit. <laughs> Shush. Shave. I think I forgot to pack my razor and kit. I'm sure the pharmacy downstairs has them. Don't be too long in that bath. Don't you worry. They're total virgins. What 
Wait. Which one's our room? Lobby's that way. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna snoop first. I wanna get this guy killed. Yeah, let's go in here. Let's do it. Better not. <laughs> Damn it. I want you to die a slow, painful death. Hmm. I could have sworn this was the way we came up. It's a wee bit dark over here. Oh, I think this might be open. Screw the shaving kit. Screw my wife. We're going in. What? <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Gamer. Oh, I almost died there. Okay, or uh, Marty, hello, how are you? If links on screen, character can whip items through inventory. Marty, how are you doing today? Oh yeah, I stole this. Nice. Oh, she just like inhaled chloroform, like powdered chloroform, if that's a thing. Yeah, she just took that in. The timing. <laughs> that timing was really good. <laughs> yeah, fuck. God damn it. Darth, hello. The hash singing slasher. The sash bringing. The hash bringing. Darth, how are you today? Is that you, darling? Jeff? I can't believe they had, did they actually have like bathrooms in the oh, hallway at old hotels? Playing another game. Was that a thing? No, fuck that, we're investigating. <laughs> well, we're gonna die now. Okay, Mr. Sneaky. You can't sneak up on me, Mr. <laughs> Oh shit. Holmes. I had a feeling it would be him. Hello, my What are dear. you doing in here? Jeff! I don't think he can quite hear you. <laughs> oh, get away from me! But I'm not finished yet. I said get <laughs> Don't fight it. So if I would have relaxed, well, I'm sure he just would have came behind us do. and like would have just Run, dude. Calm yourself, sir. Save yourself. I've seen your wife has had an accident. <laughs> Darth, I'm doing well. We started a new game tonight. Is there a problem, sir? Go, go to the lobby, go to the lobby. Oh. Yeah, baby. I can't do anything. This is all the game. By all means, continue standing there. Don't try to like break out somewhere. Oh 
Okay, I, I succeeded in getting them both killed. Wait, is that a bad thing they watch each other die? Shit. <laughs> Oopsie. Okay, wait. Uh, I I don't I didn't even know I I chose to run from run from Holmes, leaving Marie. I didn't even know I did that. So that's I guess my bad. I didn't have anything heavy enough for Holmes to hit with. Where was I? Been, where was I picking that up? I never purchased. Oh, I guess I purchased the powder of tin. I did. I didn't even know that was like gonna. Whatever. Fuck this. That's bullshit. There's a lot of decisions made, and I didn't realize I was making half of them. I thought I was just gonna look at the damn powder. Wow, look at this. Oh, it's wonderful. Only the best for you, my dear. Mother would simply die. It's so I say, popular. good man. Do you work here? Hello. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Oh yeah, I forgot like the intro. It's like hardcore Nickelback. It's not, but I mean, just <laughs> yeah, I did get an achievement, so I can't feel bad about that, right? This is gonna be a good one. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> God, I'm on edge tonight. Cheers, gamer. Is it? <laughs> oh, the, the shotgun. <laughs> the shotgun's super loud. This music, though. <laughs> I have to watch this whole thing. I've already seen this intro before. I wonder if they actually... I'm curious. I wonder if they changed, like, the... Um, some of the imagery and stuff to match like the new game. I guess I never looked at that. Oh, that's why he judges me the whole time. I'm gonna stress out. I wanna do really well for him, but I think he's gonna get annoyed by all my decisions. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if I can do this this right. Man of Medan, I did not do. I did okay. I think I killed two people. Okay, we need business. We need business right now. Oh, you're here. Have you been waiting long? Welcome back. I do enjoy seeing a familiar face. Last time, no one survived. I wonder if you were even trying. What? I did fairly well, ma'am, Dan. It's I'll so have you know. To have company. For a long time, I was on my own. I can barely recall a time when I wasn't here, watching over these tales. And what good are stories without somebody to experience Marty. them? This you know I'm a goofy goober. About those who I haven't got the goofy goober drunk face. For their art to be 
made pure. Art can elicit all sorts of reactions. Delight, inspiration, desire, yes, but also doubt, fear, dread. The way you react, the decisions you make, will affect this story. Hidden in the world, you'll find dark pictures. They give glimpses of the possible consequences of your choices. And sometimes, it's the smallest choices that can have the biggest repercussions. Mm, yeah, I'll make some of those. I'll make some mistakes. You're along responsible the way. for what happens. <sighs> You're culpable. I can't interfere. That's very much against the rules. I can only observe what happens and record any significant events. I thought you were able to give me oh. hints. I'll be at shitty hints. Things. They're very old. People used to call them obbles. They'd put them in the mouth of the recently deceased to pay the ferryman. Look out for them. You'll find them in the strangest places. I'll be happy to exchange any that you find. Ooh. And I'll certainly make it worth your while. I thought they put them in the, on their eyes. Well, shall we start? The game is afoot. And I will be watching. And judging. Oh, I want to do well for you, sir. My name is Kate Wilder. I've got a master's in criminal psychology. I'm an investigative journalist and hope to make a difference. You may have recently seen my interview on Chicago AM on... And, uh, and yeah, it's really tough when just being honest means everyone thinks you're a bitch. I'm not sure I've got issues to deal with things, everyone. I'm working on it. I... Alright, we need to give a bet on which one I'm going to kill first. I will get money. <gasps> she was in the, the boat one. Was that Man of Medan? Man, how do you even start? I'm sick of being on my own. Sorry, do you start with qualifications or, um, like personal info? Because I don't, I mean, will anyone access this? I'm kind of private, actually. Uh, yeah, Charlie Lonitz, UK originally. I've uh, been here. He looks familiar. Years. The last series was so on track, it was, uh, it was a very beautifully conceived and, um, didn't quite uh, uh, hit the mark as I was hoping it would. So they're all going to be invited to the hotel. And I think we've heard quite enough. Enough? <laughs> oh, I've barely begun, Your Honor. You don't seem to understand. I was born with the devil in me. I could not help the fact that I was a murderer any more than a poet can help the inspiration to sing. God, that's kind of fucked up. I kind of wonder if Very some people are like that. Like, your honor. Make I'm sure a killer, and that's just how I am. With cement, put me deeper than anyone else, and cover the ground with more cement, cause trust me. Just being dead ain't enough to stop me from killing again. On May 7th, 1896... Oof. Herman Mudgett, Sounds good, Mark. Thank you so much for stopping Henry by, friend. Holmes, Have a great night. His neck did not snap from the force of hanging. Oh. Records indicate he hung, slowly suffocating for over 15 minutes, until finally the monster was dead. America's first serial killer confessed to 27 murders, but his investigators sifted through the traces he left behind following his path from city to city, the number grew significantly. Nearly 200 lives. Nope, I was gonna say 27's a lot. America's first serial killer, and possibly the worst. 200 though? He was buried as Come requested, on. under concrete. Ah, uh, thanks, was Marty. Was he hoping to hide from God's judgment? Or did he truly want to keep the devil from climbing out and killing again?
So. What do you think? We hate it. What garbage is to be this? Honest, Charlie, this is a pilot. Okay, I was right. <laughs> Lonnet Entertainment. Charles Lonnet, please. Speaking. Charlie is fine. My name is Grantham Dumet. What can I do for you, Mr. Dumet? Actually, it's what I can do for you. Hear me out. We're gonna go stay in the hotel. Mr. Dumet, this all sounds amazing, but I, uh, I just, I'm waiting to hear what the catch is. No offense. None taken. I'm in a privileged position. I don't need for much, but my time is at a premium. We need to do this today. I'll send a car for you this afternoon, 4 p.m. Be ready. This afternoon? We're talking a couple of days shoot. I told my team they're free this weekend, and frankly... Is it me or the graphics look a little bit without them, this shittier is dead in the water. than Man of Medan? We, uh... I've told you what I have. Please don't waste my time. Am I sending the car or not? Yes, of course. We're in. I'll get them there. I promise. Let's do it. Like, they still look good, don't get me wrong, but I feel like, I don't know, something Mr. off Mr. about you? them. We... Right. Let's load up, guys. All right, got it. I'm good. <laughs> Sorry. Are you? Tension. This is gonna be grand, people. Adventure. <laughs> Excitement. Anyone? Road trip. Hurray. This is gonna be great, guys. I can't tell if they like each other or <laughs> not. Do we know where we're going exactly? You don't have surprises. You know what this just reminds me of? Don't say it. Topeka. Exactly. Me, no money in my pocket, a dead phone, and lost in the middle of goddamn Topeka. That wasn't my fault. It was 100% your fault. Because you fly by the seat of your ass. So, come on, Charlie. What do we know about this guy? He's rich. He's a recluse. He's obsessed with H.H. Holmes. Totally sane, I'm sure. We're going to a property he inherited from a relative. That's who had the obsession with Holmes. Some of the rooms are full recreations from the murder cult. Ooh. Dumet has blue. Okay. Documents so we're going to. When I said this would save the show, I was not exaggerating. And you substantiated all of this. Just. I believe we're going to like. Exact replica. Sorry for all the mystery. Before we go any further, I Professor, have hello. Have How are you? While this may sound strange that I invite you to film the collection inside my home, I cannot allow any personal devices that may share information that could know about my this? business or lifestyle. No, fuck that. I'd be like, rules. one of you needs to keep your phone. All you wish to use must be authorized by me first. I require privacy and discretion. I must insist. This place, his rules. Look, what he's offering us is worth it. Could be making us pay, but he isn't. Fuck that. No one of us needs to keep our phone. Like, we won't pull it out. No. Fine. No. For the show. I'm telling you, this is going to be great. You said that in Topeka. Like, I don't care. I'm like, I'll wait outside. Like, no. One of us has to have a phone for 911. Absolutely not. But even that, if we get separated. And we're not with that person that has the phone, and we need to have a one. No. Red flag, like number ten here so far. <laughs> this dude is so rich. Shouldn't he have service or something? Is this guy gonna help? <clears throat> no, really. I got it. Thanks, bro. Don't sweat it, jackass. Okay, so now what? I'd love to get some footage of the lake and the scope of this. Not with all the mist and fog. 
There. Come on high, we'll get a better look. That's certainly um, up there. The, the visuals will be great. We'll, we can frame up over the mist. Charlie, you'll hack up a lung before you're halfway up there. I'm fit as a butcher's dog. Mom, this is crazy. What? <laughs> we'll be fine. Let's go, Charlie. Be careful, guys. Nice knowing you. Come on. Shoot footage from the top of the lighthouse. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Just want to look. Wait, can I climb this side too? Nope, okay. I'm gonna be very thorough with my, um, <laughs> with my investigation, because if they're gonna die, they're gonna die the worst way possible. Nobody's walking out of here alive. If I have anything to do with it. Hey, guys, hurry up. You're on it. Blah. Jesus, that is loud. It's meant to be heard from miles away. Well, yeah, I know that in theory, but. Cliff erosion. It doesn't look too serious. The warning about everything falling into the ocean. I'm gonna say we trusted and not die. Nah, this sign is something the lawyers made them put up. I'm sure it's fine. That's foreshadowing for sure. Listen, Mark, I just wanted to say, um, thanks for backing me up, man. What? About getting this footage? No, for the whole trip. You know some of the crew can be challenging. To work with. Jamie and Kate would never have agreed to come. Sorry, I know I'm being really spastic I with the camera. I don't want to miss anything. The episode was such a mess. We needed all the help we could get. Right. Yeah. I guess we do. Remember the victim is the Great Storm of That's May 1st, 1907. 187 lives. The crew passenger of the SS Cassiopeia, which crashed into the rocks at the base of these cliffs. I don't know why I read it with such optimism. Because it's actually a really dark thing. Parkour. I'd like to take a couple weeks off, go see my family. I need you in post. I really appreciate that concerning eye of yours, you know. I got a lot going on. Keegan's barking. Oh, right, yeah, of course. Sure. Take a couple of weeks. I'm not gonna use yeah, the together. lighter right now. I'll be fine in post. I don't wanna waste you it. Do the same. Take some time out. You got any family you can go and bother? Oh, well. No, Mrs. Bonnet, you got hiding in some closet somewhere? Married to the job. Married to the job. <laughs> How's that marriage working out? Well, from what I hear about real marriages... Wait, art of balance, okay. <laughs> Married to the job. Uh, uh. Oh, I hate that. That's going to be like a quick time event, and I'm going to fail it. Epically. We're really going all this way for for one shot. I appreciate the. <laughs> Damn it! Gosh, what the hell is that? A mannequin, you know, 
God. Hanging out. Maybe it's part of some of the museum. Right. That's probably it. Oh, that one really hurt. <sighs> okay. I should have seen that coming. That got me. <laughs> it was that one hurt. It hurt so bad. <laughs> Lavish. I'm glad I'm not. I wasn't the only one. Oh, freaking hell! <laughs> if you're watching on your phone, yeah. the number of times I've seen those jump scares, I'm like, <gasps> just drop the whole thing. Always the photographer. I can't exactly turn it off. There's a lot of crossover between the creative stuff and the commercial stuff. Hmm. There's a few different ways to go. Okay, that. hang on. Just crossover with Kate hasn't exactly. We agreed to let that drop for the weekend. Just making sure your head's in the game. Locked. <laughs> oh yeah, it's old-fashioned beanie. This thing hasn't been manned in ages. Why's the horn still going? Because they didn't decommission the fog. It's all automatic now. What year is it? Keep it up, team. This should be a uh, nope, nope, I wasn't done. Turn up, there you go. Okay, Jesus. Last night's fog horn test was successful. The automation's all up and running. We'll do a final trial tomorrow when we pack up the kit. A couple, week, couple of you have reported that homeless guy hanging around again. Roughly security the compound, conducting final checks today and tomorrow. See if it's safe side, blah, blah, blah. Other than that, the work's been great. All projects will keep up the pace and we'll be out here by the end of the week. A radio. Probably doesn't work. Did like the, the limo driver tell us to go this way? I don't understand what we're doing. Fish factory to close. Exciting times. Oh, I have to look out for those little um coin things. Come on. Can't forget that either. You sure? No. I'm optimistic. that oh just a reflection of the sun got it <laughs> oh freaking hello Darth <laughs> hello again <laughs> oh that was close Darth what have you been up to any new exciting things going on Is this the house that we're supposed to go to? This looks pretty old. Okay. Oh, <gasps> yeah, baby. What's that? Just some old coin. Find a penny. Get up. 
Find a penny, pick it up. Look, you know the old saying. Sorry I give you a hard time. Shove it up your Not butt. Again, really and all day long, today. you'll have good luck. True. I may be driving this car. What car? The Lonnie Entertainment car. But you're the one who keeps the engine going. That's not how cars work. Jesus, you try and give someone a compliment. Thanks, Charlie. Yeah. <laughs> Why? Why are they so terrifying <laughs> tonight? <laughs> just work. I hear you. That's that's like I feel like how I've been the last few weeks. It's just all all work. I could use a nap too. Work. Uh, push. Push, dude. I'm hoping things slow down a little bit here. Lavish. I like the horn. Thank you. Or the honk. Thank you. <laughs> Just a little breaking and entering. Like I said, I'm an old fashioned beanie. Everybody loves old fashions. Christ, what the hell is that? Why are we hiding? <laughs> oh God. Oh, lavish. <gasps> Thank you for the follow. Nice Cheers, you. friend. Thank you for the follow. What did I just, what just happened? Is that them breathing? No, I don't. I don't like this area of the house. I have an instant claustrophobia. Or instant claustrophobic. Whatever. You know what I'm saying. I don't like it. Jump scare. Jump scare! Just need some fresh sheets, some nice drapes, and six gallons of sanitizer. Get in the dark and say hi. Shit! Squid! <laughs> It is really dark in here, so I do I do need some shades. Squid, how you doing this evening? Let me clean them off real quick. Maybe it'll help a little bit. Oh gosh. <laughs> Christ. Uh uh Lavish, I have not played not this one. I've played like Man and Medan. And one of the others, I can think of the series, I don't remember the name, but it had to do with like witches and stuff, I think. Um, but I have not played this one yet. Oh my god, it's so dark. It's like pitch black. <laughs> uh, I had a good weekend, Squid. I hope you did too. Playing a new one. I forgot about these games. I saw a tweet about them earlier. I'm like, oh shit. I was hurt by the others, and I was ready to be hurt again, so I decided to go this route. That's why I did it. <laughs> of course you did. <laughs> I'm so glad you like it, Lavish. Uh, there's a few Spongebob ones in here. Charlie, I'm getting an uneasy feeling about this. So uh, wait, oh. Oh. Dummy, hobby. Oh. Relax. <laughs> Some hobby. What in God's name is this? I, I don't know. It, it, it appears to be a bird. Ah! I did that did not scare me. What? The thing. It moved. Well, it looks like it's like it has mechanical stuff in it, does it not? Like a battery? Little Jimmy's been experimenting with dead animals again. <gasps> Jimmy might need psychiatric help.
<laughs> oh, no, 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 I, I wanted to look at the rest of the room, damn it. Fuck. It's gonna be okay, it's all gonna be okay. I wasn't done looking in that room. Look at this. <laughs> Sound lines are strong tonight. <laughs> Greg, hello. How are you? Look, Lavish, you're going to have a heart attack being here. Welcome. <laughs> Wait, that is all we did? That's it? Two seconds? I didn't even look in the rest of the room. But at least I can see now, eh? Got him? I got that. We just had the one call. How did he know what our show was about in the first place? Yeah, just one little shot. Uh, actually, I didn't ask. That's weird. Let's just play nice, okay? Boy. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Lonnet. That's me. I'm Grantham Dumet. Everyone climb aboard and we'll head out. No, he's way too smiley and nice Mark, to be to not be a serial killer. Lady. He's gonna kill us. And this is Kate. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Dumet. I'm looking forward to seeing all it is you have to offer. We truly appreciate this. Lovely to meet you all. What say we get underway? Again, I really can't thank you enough for this opportunity. Oh. Bearing updated. Okay, that's a, that's a big jump. Okay. Of course. Sure. Was it your great uncle you said that? I did Let's see Channel. It was we're going. so good. I'll explain everything later. Sure. It was really, really oh, good. Like the HBO one, right? I watched it right after I played Chernobyl Light. Little Jimmy's gonna show us face now. Nope, okay. Who's gonna die first? Who's gonna die first? <sighs> the old guy seems like a good guy, so I kinda want him to live. Everybody else just seems like they hate each other. The guy that was with the old guy in the plaid, he seems like a good guy too. Everybody else just seems like mean and crabby and like they don't want to be there. So they let's deserve to die. To Please, let's <laughs> stay close. Stick together. Is it dangerous here? No. Like they totally deserve to die. You sure? Because you don't seem sure. It's perfectly safe. But we are a long ways from help if somebody gets hurt. So please, take care. Our track record of being safe is really safe. This way. Don't worry about your bags. I'll make sure they're brought. Okay. She seems like the type that would be bitching about it, but... Try not to call I'll try to be nice. I'll be fine. Just this pretend there's a carton of smokes at the top of the hill. <laughs> You're right. Dumet's gonna... Very soon. He's just bringing us to feed us to the monster. So I think Dumet's like... Maybe Dumet's not wanting to kill us, but he has out. to. Jamie. Just saying. You watch too many horror movies. He values his privacy. We've known that right from the start. We've known that for about two hours. Just go. Mark, get your camera. I want to grab a quick intro from here. I need some shots leading up to the house. Don't need the whole journey. Kate, talking to camera, then I'll direct you from there, okay? No photos. No recording of me at all. Is that clear? I'm a very private person. Don't worry, Mr. Dumet. Discretion is long and So you don't water. want to be on want this TikTok video? Time? Please. The light is good. I'm ready to go, Aaron. It sounds clear. Okay, let's go for a take then. Is Kate's face ready? Bitch, I'm always camera ready. Stop trying to make me like you. Rolling. <laughs> Speed. And <laughs> action. I've just arrived on the private island which claims to have genuine artifacts from Hate Hate Home's reign of terror. I'm heading to the house right now. 
Perfect, Kate. Now turn to face the house and start to walk. Asha. Okay, that's enough. And cut. We really do need to get going. Anything you say, Mr. Dumas. This way. He. Still some more shots, right? Okay, I can deal with people with anxiety because I have anxiety, but he's he's very anxious. You need to you give him some weed. <laughs> Craig, cheers! Thank you for the bits, friend. Squeeby. Oh, is that what it said? Trying to hide. What do you want to do? What you did that time with those cops in Glendale. Seriously? Kill them. <laughs> Naturally. Oh, oh, oh my damn it! What happened? You okay? Oh. Did you took up your ego again? We should get her up to the hotel. Oh my god, I can barely move it. Jamie, stay with her. Why me? Because you know first aid. Remember how you patched her up? In Glendale? Oh, right. Okay. We'll find some ice and a bandage and come back. Do you have that at the hotel? Yes, sure. Then let's go. What is going on? Come on. I'll clue you in later. Been taking acting classes again? Yeah, yeah. What's Charlie want? A better lay of the land. And we're the scouts because? I'm charming. And you can hotwire your way past security. Come on. Craig, what have you been up to? Anything new? Explore the island. Get someone killed. Hey, can I ask you something and get a straight answer? You know. Right, you make me a smart ass reply <gasps> okay, that? shot at me. That works both ways. Fine. Well, tell me the truth. Is there any saving this show? Maybe. If there's some sort of magical holy grail of footage or information. Okay. What 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 is this? Holy shit, did I miss that many already? Region to be had here. Jesus. You think that's likely? No. At best, we'll get some nice B-roll. That's not gonna save our asses. Yeah, another coin! Oh, that one guy's gonna be so pleased with us. We have two coins already? Got it. I, I got the gist of it, thank you. <laughs> Bit of a scramble. Damn it, what did I miss in that one room? At the lighthouse. Cause there had to have been stuff in there. Watch your head. Why did she run so weird? Okay, I'm just scouting the whole area out. Don't want to miss anything. Did I go over here yet? Go in. Damn, can I not go in here? Uh, you could have there told we go. us to dress for a trek. Okay, sorry, I'm just making sure I get everything. This is an investigation. Can't be too careful now. Try 
not to fall and die. I don't want to see Mark cry. Thanks for the concern. Really. <laughs> I don't like that. I feel like that's going to be a quick time event later and it's just going to blow up in my face. I think it's about five minutes. Oh, this goes. Well, straight up and down the hill. Yeah. But what's on the other end? Almost hasn't been no it has not. Hasn't been fifteen minutes. <laughs> God damn it. I might as well just change it to like I'll I'll leave them on for like ten minutes or something. Do you live out here on this island? Hide. With your family? How do I hide? She died. Shit! Mr. Dumet, is this an actual palm tree? Was this shipped into the island? I I don't think so. I forgot how to hide. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't know. That was panic. It's fun not telling you. <laughs> it works really well when you don't tell me. It does not feel like it's been fifteen minutes though. This way we're gonna beat them up there. That's too small. Yeah, before I go in any doors. Over there? Before I go in any doors, I wanna inspect stuff. Damn it, if this is if this is how we're getting up to the hotel, I'm be so pissed. I'm not done searching everything. There's no way it works. No fuck! If I wanted to go on nature hike, I wouldn't have moved to the city. Can we go back? This shit is not in my job description. Damn it! I thought we were just gonna like explore the little cart. Son of a bitch. I didn't even look in the God damn it. That makes me so mad. Like, I'm trying to be thorough. <laughs> it just made me so mad. <laughs> I stood there like a ton. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so pissed right now. Duvet is not going to know what to think when he sees us up here. Okay. If I can get the car moving and stop it here, we'll be able to get across. No. We're going to explore first. You see the control panel? It's trashed. I don't even think there's power. Oh, 
All right, I'm going. It's very obvious. We have to go up here. I can't mess this up, can I? This guy's totally not going to notice if he sees this real car move. Did it just go to seven? Oh my god, am I stuck? Over there? Oh my god, am I stuck? <laughs> am I stuck? No. No. Tell me I'm not stuck. Oh my god, a glitch. God, why do I always- why does it always happen to me? <laughs> Why? Why me? God damn it. We're stuck. We can't get out. Why? This is- this literally always happens to me. <laughs> Son of a bitch. Oh uh, no. If it turns me- if it- okay. I know. Why? Why? Okay. I'm gonna get out. We're gonna get back in. If it puts me in the exact same spot, I don't know- I don't know what to do. Ooh, it would be really nice if they kind of backtracked a little bit. Oh, okay. Be very careful when you get down from here. Nordic, hello. There we go. We did it. I'm not an engineer Maybe we can get this thing or an electrician, but my guess is on would be the best way to get things working. Not a gambling man, but... Jamie, can you fix this? <laughs> Did you see your eyes? <laughs> Did you see your eyes? Oh, doggy, thank you for the follow. Cheers. Cheers. Oh my god, I don't know if you guys saw her eyes, but like it just went from normal, all of a sudden her eyes got really big after. Can you fix this? Just got. I don't know why that was. That wasn't that funny. I'm sorry. Blue, hello. How are you? Uh, thank you again, doggy, for the follow. Press this. Okay. Here we go. Ain't no way I'm gonna fuck this up. Up. Nope. Up. Up. Okay. There we go. There we go. If the other girl would still have looked at like instructions, you know, maybe she would have been able to figure this out, but whatever. Let's look really smart in front of her. Wait, what? Ball sacks. Okay, let's try it again. Oh, okay, I'm a dumbass. Sorry. One more time. Let me just do this. A little, little bit of that. See? Genius. What puzzles? You're doing well. Awesome. Good to hear. Happy Tuesday. Let's take it to go back down. So I can explore that house. I'm gonna be salty about that. I'm gonna have to like replay this whole game. Let's 
monster here? Hear that? Hide. Blah, LT. <laughs> Why is that so hard? I mean, they, they did hear like the, the, the little cart move, so I'm sure they know we're here. <gasps> A clue. Ah, oh, the stiletto heel. We can combine them. This is just like Resident Evil. No, pick it up and keep it. And dip. Do we not pick it up? Oh, I guess we I guess we did leave the shoe. Okay. These are. It's gas. It's the ingredients McDonald's uses to make their chicken nuggets taste so damn good. Their fries sound amazing right now. Damn it, why did I bring that up? Why did I bring up food? Just needed to rest it for a minute. I think I'm okay. Let's huff the gas. Up the hill. <laughs> I really need you to stay where I say. You got it, Mr. Dumet. We're all here now. Oh. Let's head on. Dan, Everyone hello. Stay under the watchful eye of How are Mr. you? Dumet, please. Kate. What do you think? Well, I skipped a whole section. How? Whatever. We're gonna find out what's up his sleeve before too long. Oh, he's scared of bridges. Coming or what? Uh huh. You afraid of heights? Maybe. Or or heights. That too. <laughs> they have new onions. Oh, shit. We're all gonna die. Just. They have new onions. I did not know it's a thing. <laughs> oh my god! Relax, Mark. Their fries sound really good, though. Well, don't scare him anymore. You can do it. Eyes forward. Don't look down. I got it. It's fine. I'm making her know? too nice. Her personality when this started was was really rude. It's just water down there. You can swim. Besides, the bridge looks dependable. Ish. Come on. I'll help. What did they what did they change about the onions, I guess? That's it. Look, it's fine. Okay. Don't look down. Yeah. <laughs> See? Not so bad. <sighs> no, it's no, it's not, I'm not gonna break, Squid. Of course you not. Knew how to get me through the shit, didn't you? We should catch up to Mr. Dumet. Hmm. Oh, they got a thing. Sexual tension. Where is everyone? Apologies. Uh, they're all city folk. Come on, let's go. We're losing the day, people. He's gonna lock it. He's gonna lock it. That prick. We're all gonna die now. That's HHH, I'm calling it. <laughs> Chris, 
Yes, wow. Mr. Dumas, this place is magnificent. Yeah. Maybe this won't be a way uh, Triple H is the... Oh. <laughs> so he's the killer in the in the epilogue. Epilogue, is that the right? Prologue? Prologue. In the beginning ser scene. Oh. Jesus. Remember who you are. What are you doing? <gasps> Scary child. I, I saw a little girl. Up there. She's real. She's wearing like a, a leather letterman jacket. Now she's lost forever. You are such a dick. Everything in here is fragile. Please be careful. He's like, I did it. Whoa. Look at this. It's amazing. This is intense. Would you all mind signing in at the desk, please? Uh, this isn't everything. I'm sure the rest is almost here. I'll, I'll make sure it gets to your rooms. Kate's makeup taste is slowing it down. Erin, cigarettes. Blue backpack. Settle in, and I'll meet you all at dinner. At eight. Mr. Who gets the honeymoon suite? Say thank you enough times. This is truly fantastic. I told you all this was a good plan, didn't I? <laughs> I told you. What does that number mean? I don't remember that. Oh, there you are. Busy, busy, busy. You've been out in a battle day, and I have to sit here worrying. Day Sorry, mom. From you. Oh, this is kind of like the um, what's it called, Psycho? <laughs> okay, H. H. Holmes is wearing the skin of somebody. There's a lot of ways this this can go. We're gonna figure this out. It's his daughter. Sorry. You're jumpy. Oh my god. I think I peed a little. How did you not hear me coming? I was... I don't think we're the only ones here. Mm. Kate saw a little girl looking out a window at us when we were outside. That's who I saw. A little girl. Mr. Demet probably has family, his staff, maybe friends. Who knows? That said, this place does give me the willies. It's, I would uh, assume the little girl's family. It's unique. Are you singing? Oh, yeah, that's my being scared song. This is my don't be scared song. Sing it and I won't be scared long. Oh, you need don't to die. Know. I bet. She needs to die 91. first. Uh, I think I'm around the corner. <laughs> 183? You deserve to die now. <laughs> okay. Okay. Good luck out there. Don't get lost. Scream if you need me for anything. Thanks. I got you. Nothing to be scared of. Actually, hey. Yeah? Why don't you hang a second while I unpack, then I can help you find your room? Something about this place makes me want to use the buddy system. Yes. Thanks. I'd end up lost, probably. Okay. I'm, I'm curious how that plays out, because like obviously I didn't choose to invite her. So I wonder if there's something I said I did earlier that... And here we are. Well, it's, um, cozy? Disappointed. 
It's one step above one of those Japanese capsule hotels. Oh, come on. Could be way worse. Like our room in Topeka. No, do not. I've blocked that from memory and don't want it coming back. Because of the roaches? Because of you snore. Uh, where's the bathroom? Wait, what? Old school. Uh, gross school? What do I have to pee in the middle of the night? Am I gonna walk in on Charlie sitting on the pot? Guess that means there's oh, no Oh god, that's right, room. okay. The bathroom's out of the room. Well, you know. What is that? Wine, genius. Oh, I feel like if we start drinking, Charlie will find out. And lecture me, and make me feel like an asshole. Okay, narc. Again. Yeah, he does that. But... We're not on the clock. Dog and tour rigging to shoot. Which is hard to do drunk. <laughs> I'm not suggesting we get full on a hammer before we work. Why are you doing that? I'm thirsty. Also, you're cute when you work though. I don't cute? You think I'm cute? Hmm? Huh? What? Oh. I didn't say that. Do you think I'm cute? Oh, there we go. Gotta stick on my own if you want to share a lip cooties. Thanks, but I can find mine. Fine, God. Take a hint. Uh, it's uh, all the way against the wall. See it? <coughs> you okay? <coughs> Shit. <coughs> you trying to scare me now? No. Revenge? Cause good job. Oh, yeah, she's totally going to die. Because we're going to lose the inhaler at one point. You sure you're okay? Because... Yeah, Assuming she knew that she had asthma already. scaring you didn't help, did it? No. But seriously. Okay, her and Aaron are getting fault. closer. Cool. I just, I... I try to pretend like it isn't a thing, you know? Like, I don't want to be depending on an inhaler. I try to mind over matter it, but dust and allergies and I just need to be more careful. You sure? Sure. I'm sure. So, uh, yeah. Cozy. <laughs> okay, well, Narc, since you're not going to drink any wine, I will chug the whole bottle I'm myself. Try that. Now you're poisoned. It's not that bad. You're not lying? It's piquant. Decent vintage. Sure. I'm getting oaky undertones. A hint of citrus. <laughs> and I want to say a strong, healthy amount of moldy sweat dots. <laughs> Oh my god. It is. I hate you. you Mine doesn't go bad player. though. Oh, flirtatious for sure. Oh, sorry. I thought you meant to think when you were cute thing. Really? Okay, here we go. We're getting drunk. Um, if my cheeks are red, it's from this wine. Not because I am bashful. I swear. Really. Sorry. Didn't mean to make you feel weird. I, I, yeah, it's just, we work together, and Charlie is always on me about being more professional, and- I get it. No, I mean, I, I'm not saying I don't appreciate it. Er, er. Oh, here we go, here we go. You're cute, too. It's just- It's gonna happen. Um, Do it. Going in. Jump scare. What are you doing? I, oh my god, I, uh, I- Oh, you bitch! Oh my God, I'm just with you. I wanted to kiss you for months, and I was scared to make a real move. <laughs> okay, I thought she was actually being serious. Over like, oh, sorry, sorry. They're a little drunk already. Special feature unlocked. Who is that? What did I unlock? We upgraded to the 
honeymoon suite. Let's go, my love. About to get freaky. Enjoying yourself out here like some sort of pervert? Sorry, did I uh, interrupt something here? No, we're just talking shop. We're worried about the power grid handling and sex thing. <laughs> yeah, yes. If this place is running on a generator, nice. You know what it's out. I don't care. What I knew there would be one, one good thing to unlock. I can't we got find it. my room, and I need a fucking cigarette. <laughs> These funny shapes are numbers. They go up and down in order. Thank you. I've just been down there. Look, give me ten, and we should get a rough plan for getting our first shot. We have all evening. Can't we plan after dinner? I'd like to chill for a minute after the trek getting here. I want to be shooting after dinner. You've got ten minutes. Okay. We'll be down in a few then. Oh, Erin, I checked my blue bag. No cigarette. That's where I put them. Come and show me. Maybe one of us is colorblind and doesn't know what a blue bag is. Kind of being a dick. <laughs> so we're all done with what we were talking about? Great. Oh, oop, oopsie. Cool. Sorry. Oh, I fucked that up. Oh, God. Good luck finding your rooms. Oh, no. Downgraded. What was he what was he in? I thought he looked familiar, but I don't know exactly what it was. Oh <gasps> come on, come on, let's go. Let's go. So he did bring us here. He brought us here as sacrifices. And now he's bailing. Where the hell are they going? Okay, okay, I got this theory. He was somebody that was part of a previous group that came out. And maybe he was like sacrificed. If he brought a new group in. So maybe somebody here is going to be sacrificed. And has to bring the next group in. Okay, calling it. Got got multiple theories running right now. They just, they just totally dipped out though. Do it. Check for two-way mirror. Check it. Oh, okay. Okay, so the main guy's name is Charlie. Kate wanted you to have this. Breaking down walls, navigating the maze of anxiety. Are you fucking kidding me? I think she thought it might help with your stress. Or... Absolutely not. I'm not stressed. Okay. Do I look fucking stressed? Uh. That was rhetorical. Well, your cards came out nice enough. Oh yeah, embossing makes a huge difference you old guys love business cards <laughs> old school you old school guys i also put it on heavy stock and did the logo in foil Damn. okay we can use it to open doors I have one ready for me to do that. did you find them i no i swear i put them in here i don't understand <sighs> Check the other bag. Didn't you already? Just look. Get get a little edgy when I haven't had my cigarette. It's only clothes and uh Don't one of you kids have a vape pen. Oh uh, this. Notice of eviction. Oh the studio? I paid the studio rent out the wrong account and the check bounced. It's nothing. I just have to use another it's fine. So you're saying not to worry? Worry about finding my bloody cigarettes. They're gone, Charlie. Gone? Just like that. Are you saying somebody took them? I I don't actually I can see Kate doing that. Or Jamie. I'm sorry. 
Uh, balls, I don't know. It's fine. Let's just get on with things. I think I should move my camera because that's where all this the This place is massive. Surely there is a pack Oopsie. of cigarettes in here somewhere. Even if they're ancient. You need them that bad? There was a bar off the lobby. There must be cigarettes in the bar, right? I mean, technically it's well, not legal to so you guys can actually bar, see. So. Come on, we're checking. What if you find the them first, all will be forgiven. Options are Hang on, just need to check the room real quick. You never know. Oop, ah, see? Could have lost something. Kill them all, God will recognize his own. Cool. Just gonna leave this out in case anybody else wanted to read this. Don't mind my eviction notice. It's my spare cap. Exactly the same? Well, it suits me. What's weird about that? He's got a point. He's got a point. It was over here. La. Wait, we have a key card. Not a key card, we have a business card. Oh, I know you said it wasn't a thing, but that bank notice. You're fixating, which normally I applaud, but not about this. I mean, <laughs> oh, we fuck. losing our jobs, right? Damn it. It's television. Everyone is always Damn in it. danger of losing their job. <laughs> sure, but it's fine. Erin, please. I've squared it all with the network. We're still working on It's been a while for their sound alert, so that was good timing. Not me. I applaud you. You have to let this go. We're fine, Erin, okay? Okay, I think got any everything in the hallway that we can get. Oh, this is like a fake wall right here. Going this way. Don't follow me. Damn it. Move. Move me first. Me first. Hey, Charlie. <laughs> I was hoping next season maybe I could do more with the sound design. No. The creative stuff. No. Erin, what you already do for this company is very valuable to us. Carrying your bags and picking up your laundry. Exactly. Absolutely. And for getting my cigarettes. Get ahead in this industry, you have to pay you your dues. Dumb ass. Show you're ready to muck in. I. I think you should get an assistant. An assistant. Oh, it was just a stupid idea, Charlie. I'm an just... assistant. A person. So this was. They checked out <clears throat> right before us. Pardon me. The editing. The audio. Look, I just think you've got. So much to give, so much experience. Wait, what? And it's an opportunity to pass that knowledge on. Right. Yes, I suppose it is. And an assistant wouldn't lose my cigarettes, would they? Exactly. Oh, so, assistant wouldn't lose cigarettes. Got do it. Do you still want to direct movies, Charlie? I am directing. Okay, so. No, but I mean real movies. People are checking like out after star. six days. Erin, there's something important that you have to understand. In the work that we do, the very important work, the truth, is the star. Oh, right. The truth is the star. Sorry, Charlie. Right after my... So you don't want to direct. I'll stop there. Can we move on from this? <laughs> I suppose I should be thankful. It's just my cigarettes that are missing and not our gear. Love them alerts. <laughs> I do too. They're great. Just sometimes they give me heart attacks. <laughs> oh, fuck. Hey, <laughs> Perfect timing, that. Darth. You could just ask him about cigarettes. He's already dead. Don't you understand? Nope. Don't open it yet. Don't open it yet. 
I need to snoop. Okay, open it now. I can I can unlock this with a thing. I have a thing. Nobody's going to be there. Jackpot. Erin. That wasn't there before, the was it? Oh, baby. Why don't I go check for a gift shop? This looks like The Shining. Like I've that that's a shining bar right there. Today, and this dust farm is exactly what I don't need. A gift shop might have cigarettes. Exactly. Had a girl. Like they're 100% going for the shining vibe. I get it. <clears throat> Hello. Mr. Dumet. Hello. Morning to you all. I'm Chester Bell, Assistant Director at the Federal Ooh, Bureau of hello. Investigation. At approximately 0530 local time, a team led by Special Agent Hector Monday and supported by law enforcement officers conducted a raid of a motel room just outside Birmingham, Alabama to apprehend Manny Sherman, the man known as the Beast of Arkansas. Using state-of-the-art psychological profiling techniques, Special Agent Monday and members of his task force not only identified their suspect, but predicted his movement with unerring actions. Well, hello. I'm delighted How to are say you? We have Cheers. Man. How are you doing this fun Tuesday? I swear to God, if there's not a bartender in here, I'm going to lose it. I will jump over that counter and I will make my own drink. Before I play the jukebox, just make sure I get everything. Uh, Kelly Schroeder, Jeeve at the hotel. On Friday, November 17, 2017. The accidents that befell the skeleton crew and the like is nothing short of a tragedy, and I part feel responsibly. In honor of them, I spent the last several months applying the finishing touches to the hotel, and I'm proud to say that we are almost ready to open to the public. Please allow me to extend sincere gratitude and invite yourself and those of your team to join me for the opening ceremony. I promise a spectacular evening with themed entertainment, including a bar barbershop quartet. I'm sure you agree that all of your hard work was worth it. You enjoyed the unique hotel experience. Richard, love dick. Oh, okay, that's me. Oh no, he's gonna die. Love these games. I do too. I forgot. I forgot about the Dark Anal Anthology, whatever they're called. I forgot about this series in general until like today. So makes oh shit! Have you been standing there the whole time, dude? Wow! An animatronic. Ha! That's what amazing. would be, Mr. Demet, sir? <laughs> I love a packet. That was me last summer. That hot. Yeah, that's right. It was really hot there. <laughs> Hello? Hopefully everything's good to go this summer, Squid. Hello? Packet of smokes. Try and get a blanket there. Too good to be true. Never mind. Thank you, Robo Bowman. Certainly, sir. Whatever you wish. <laughs> no fucking way. Oh. 
Thank you very much, my mechanical friend. It's much appreciated. This robot's gonna like, appear right behind us. Do cigarettes expire? Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh, of course it wants exact change. Damn it! Oh, the, no, no, robot's not gonna like this. Oh yeah, use that. Yeah, get some. Nice. <laughs> Fucking god damn it. Next round's on me. Promise. Gosh. Dang it. Yes. So wait. He's got a lighter. He's got a lighter in his hand. Clearly we cannot use that lighter Oi. at some point. Because Oi. it's probably going to ignite something. What am I doing? What am I doing? Life would be so much easier with that in my jacket pocket. I was trying to hit. I don't know where to hit. I really don't like the robot. AI is getting a little too, too intense these days for me. You piece of shit, don't do this to me. Oh, oh, please turn around. Antique rubbish. Give them to me. Give me my cigarettes. Right. That's it. I'm going to go and get my key grip, and they are going to kick the shit out of you. Hey, Charlie. Shit. He's going to die. Yeah. Oh, okay. Still in the bar. I think it's dinner time. We should get everyone out. <sighs> okay, I'm coming. And I'm coming back for you with a fucking pry bar. Are you alone in there? Who's that behind the bar? What? No. F fuck that. Oh, because that, that bird that we saw earlier? Was like, had like all that wiring in it. Okay, okay. I don't know what that has to do with anything, but they're hey, obviously made by the same person. On an intro segment. You want to shoot now? Yeah, if we get it shot and in the back, maybe Charlie will stop rewriting everything I come up with. Yeah. <laughs> okay, sure. Oh, they have sex sexual tension too. What? Nothing. Just give me a sec, and then I'll be good to go. I'm supposed to buy nothing? Is eating away at you? Yes. How many times have you cleaned that lens? I'm just prepping my gear. Really? Yeah. Always focusing on the detail, Mark. What about taking a huge risk and just do something? I watched you fuss for a whole week before you turned down that job offer, all because you had to take <gasps> one extra train Oh, God, to get that there. scared me. I don't know why the hell it scared me. The vibrate did. The job wasn't the right move. The train thing confirmed it. Lindsay. I don't buy it. You don't have to buy it. Come on, let's just shoot this. Let's use natural light so we can do it alone. Didn't the Yay! Have yeah, I'm doing remember. good in the relationships. I just want to look decent. At least I want everybody to like each other before they die. Uh, enthusiastic? I don't we know. We can get Jamie to set up some lights. No. I don't want to wait around. I want to shoot something before dinner, otherwise Charlie is going to be in my face all evening. And to be honest... Oh, fuck. 
I just yeah. Uh, why are you letting I'm really on edge with this me? game, I think. I feel like if Jamie knew the truth, you might back off. I mean, they all just assume. I can't decide if that's sweet or selfish. Or both. Oh, I don't know. I don't know what, what is it. I don't know what he's going to say before I say, can I say something? Shit. Creating the golden hour. We should be able to find a good spot. <laughs> I don't know why you camera dorks call it that. It's 15 minutes at best. Damn it, I should have asked the question. I didn't know what he was going to ask, though. 15 minutes at the most. <laughs> Look, let's go find I know, and that's, a, that's a good point, Squid. Are doing this? <laughs> you're probably asking me because your arms are too short for a good selfie angle. My arms are not short. <laughs> Where to? Uh, the balcony would make for a cool angle. Let's find a way up there. How's the new place? It'll do for now. You like it? A lot of doors. It's just a place to keep my shit in crash. Short term lease, so I can take my time. Should see what's Whoa. in here. There, Bucko. I was just checking for light. Remember our talk about boundaries? I need my room to be my private, safe place. Sometimes Hang on. I'm glad we went to therapy. Other times, it makes for some weird ass rules. I was worried you'd be sleeping on the couch in the studio while you obsessed over finding the perfect place with the right wall color near the proper train station or bus stop or Maybe this is the shining hotel. Discussion no flies out list. Oh, hello. Yeah. You're probably right. This looks okay, slightly fucked up. So since we can't do it tomorrow, is next weekend okay to come and get my stuff? Oh, were they married? Okay, that's why the, there was sexual tension, at least to a degree. <gasps> uh oh. <clears throat> hmm. At least he wasn't dying in that one, I guess. This game sucks. Yeah, I feel like Dumet is the kind of dude who loses his shit if you break his rules. Oh, what was your first clue when he took away our phones like we were kind of teenagers? Okay, talks about the... Oh, I think this is the... Maybe that was the guy that was super obsessed with the serial killer. Not like with an axe, though. You can send his monopad to reach height. What, what the hell is a monopad? Oh, it's really the camera. <laughs> that was so delayed. I'm so bad. <laughs> Quick time. Okay, births, deaths, marriages. Mr. Robert Hall of Silver Spring announced the birth of their daughter, Marilyn, on June 10th at White Oak. Okay. I don't know what information that gave us. Nope, hang on, hang on, there's room over here. Look at this wallpaper. 
This is old as hell. Everything here is old as hell. I was expecting an old exterior, but remodeled inside. <gasps> oh. Looks like Dumet is trying to preserve things. Can't be easy all the way out here. Hang on. I like Look it. at this, and then we'll go upstairs. Person, but at some point, you have to give up the... January 1, 1956. Come on. You know all this. What do you want? Dex! <laughs> <laughs> You've been doing your research. I haven't just back God damn it. <laughs> what are my favorite television programs? That one hurt my heart. <laughs> Web. What were your friends like? Hello. <laughs> what is this? Taking a survey. You're How are you, my friend? Something. Oh, cheers. They kill you to be direct. You oh. want to know what inspired me? How oh, gee. As if I wasn't an original? <laughs> well. I've been a wee bit jumpy tonight, Web. One man <laughs> How have you been? Henry Howard Holmes. Why? Because he, he was number was one. Oh, no. America's SpongeBob. I invented the trade. He set the benchmark, you know? My white knife's been made. <laughs> Good. Read a book. You think because I stuck a blade in some people and get off on it, I'm not smart? I, uh, allegedly killed 13 people before you got smart enough to find me. Oh, is this him talking? Okay. So much going on. <clears throat> set in. Right. Work or That's stuff it. outside of work? What? This is who we got here. Uh, there. See that key? Just need to find a way through. <laughs> what do we need the key for? Oh, is that probably the balcony, I bet? Old house. Island beaches with dead fish. Animals in the wood. Could be anything. Whatever it is. Oh, ass fish. shot. Hello. Hello, hello. I'm gonna get the hiccup soon. <clears throat> oh, what's... What's all this then? Okay. I'm assuming the keys for the balcony. That's probably a really good guess. That or we're just gonna completely risk this guy's life. Keep your head down. Is she with me? She's not even with me. I don't know what's happening. Ooh, career change and purchase. Ooh. Well, it sounds like exciting things. I hope things are going well. Okay, how is how is this going to work? Uh, uh, turn it. Good job. Climb this. No. Okay. Oh, I'm oh I'm an idiot. Okay. Bring it right here. Here, right in in between there. Can you can you push it? Okay, this, this takes some skill. Hang on, this is like a puzzle. <laughs> Gotta wiggle it, wiggle it a little bit. There you go. We did it. Puzzles. Oh my gosh. 
Well, congratulations. That's a big deal. In Wisconsin, so you're moving then? Congrats, my friend. Sounds like a lot of big changes. Sounds like a good thing. This should work. Mark, you okay in there? I'll be right back. Yeah, this this is a puzzle if I've ever had a puzzle. Super hard. Just really annoying. This puzzle's annoying for some reason. I don't have it yet. Okay, well, fingers crossed then. Hope everything works out. We did it. This better be the room. Damn it. What? Darth, I see you. Boom. Puzzle solved. Woo! Got it. Look what I got for you, honey. Be impressed. It's a key. You would not believe how much work I had to go through to get that. <laughs> what? This isn't even the goddamn balcony. Death, come on. It's not that high. My vertigo is saying Wait, is this like an indoor balcony, maybe? I guess? What are you worried about, Miss? I don't Always know. be camera ready. You look amazing as usual. Aww. Look at that. Okay, we apparently Aaron and I are not getting along. Oh, it's that ring and the necklace from that one girl. The girl that we basically played. Okay, check this out. It's his hat. Who? H. H. Holmes. Try it on. Do it. Do it. Do it. Put it on. Fuck! You okay? No! I just... This fucking thing popped out of nowhere. No one play anymore. <laughs> See? What is it? It's a, it's a horror game. Animatronic? Yeah, a fucked up looking one. It can't hurt you. It scared you. It scared you twice. God damn, that one, that jump scare sucked. Hey, Charlie, it's eight. Dinner time. Damn it. We didn't get anything. There's, There's a lot of jump scares in this game. On. Let's not keep Charlie waiting or we'll never hear the end of it. Oh, this is going to be a long, long playthrough. Hey, <laughs> with this rate, with how many jump scares there's been. For me when all I did was Fuck. My job. I'm the one doing the talking on camera, not him. Come on, you came in hot on him and you know it. Not that you're wrong, but... 
You know, he meets anger with more anger. This is on him, Mark, not me. Mm. The rest of us are tired of watching you guys fight. And I'm tired of having those fights. He's just jealous. Jealous? Yeah, he doesn't like that I'm the one getting invited on to talk show. You mean talk show? The point is, I'm the one people ooh, see on ooh, screen. Ooh, you went down. They want to talk to me, and he's being a baby about it. I can't say half the shit he writes. It may look good on the page, but there's more to it. I'm trying to help, and he throws it back in my face. Because you... Because he thinks you're just trying to get content for your showreel. What if I was? I don't know. That's how directors have to be. It's their job. They have a vision. Ego has to play into it a little bit. That's why I just shut up and point the camera. That doesn't mean he has to be an asshole. No, but imagine if you're in Damn it, I don't think 40 something still waiting for your big break. Kate, this show is the closest he'll ever have to success. Fuck. I guess. <laughs> the ship keeps going down. I am moving on from Lon at Entertainment. Mm. Good for you. That's that's definitely the right call for where your career is going. That maybe that'll help her. Sincere, because it is. Charlie would replace us in a second if he wouldn't be inconvenient. Okay, there we go. I just gotta make her happy. I deserve better than this. So do you. We all do. What a stunning performance. Shit. Give up news and be an actress. I was quite moved by all that. Fucking Oscar worthy. You don't know what we were talking about. I heard enough, thank you. I know what portrayal sounds like. I'm particularly disappointed in you, Mark. Whatever your future plans may be, right now, you work for Lonix Entertainment. And Lonix Entertainment employees are meeting for dinner to speak with our host. Charlie, I'm sorry. And Lonit employees Balls. are professionals. Yes? So start acting like it. She puts her headphones on. She can't, hand Great. can't handle it. Happy? You have a future, and now I don't. That man is a goddamn child. And somehow we all sink to his level. Oh, stressful. Dude's into animatronics. I got it. He's probably making one for like all of us. Since hers is the first, she's probably gonna die first. Hey guys. Hey. Hey guys, how's it going? Wild out there, huh? <laughs> Go for the other girls. It's okay if we pour some wine. God, please do. Has anyone seen Mr. Dumet? Shouldn't we wait for him? Just pour more. Let's all just relax. We just sat down, give the man a moment. Who's the host? I haven't seen a soul here aside from the groundskeeper. He's probably cooking dinner himself. Ah, oh, Mr. Dumet! I love what you've done with your hair. We started on the wine. Hope that's all right with Dumet? you. Yeah, back to it ain't coming. Wait, what? Why? You saw all the snide things you tweeted from his limo. I didn't. What are you talking about, Jamie? He got back aboard the ferry and left. What? <laughs> when? Right after we got to our rooms. He just left. You're sure? Can't be. You must be mistaken. I'm not blind. I know what I saw. Why would he leave? That makes no sense. Well, you brought us here as bait. We're all gonna die. They're in a big ass hurry. Guess you were right. There was some kid here. I saw them together when I was looking for my room. Another perfect Charles Lonnet plan comes together. What's our next step, boss? Swim for shore? Why would he invite us here and to dinner and then just leave? Balls. I'm sure he has his reasons. Who knows what could have cropped up? 
Maybe he ordered pizza for dinner and the dock is as far as they deliver. This could work to our advantage. How? Well, think about it. We're still here, surrounded by perfect visuals. The plan is still on track. There has to be a legit reason he left. We shouldn't leap to conclusions. Guys, am I the only one who's getting really freaked out by this place? And by Mr. Dumet. Yeah, the, the killer's gonna kill her first because she's get, she's picking up a bunch of shit. To say it. I'm sure I didn't decide with Jamie on this one. Thank you. Lower your voices. Why? He's not here. But that doesn't explain why he stitched out on us. He had to go back to establish an alibi. What are you? You know. <laughs> So when our bodies wash up on the other side of the lake, he has plausible deniability. Oh, oh God, Shit. Jamie. Can you stop trying to make this worse? You're not helping. Okay, fine. Who are we missing? Don't come crying to me if you end up dead. What is wrong with you? I'm just saying. Are we missing a person? Or is there just five of us? Guess you never found your cigarettes. Yes. I did find the machine, but just like everything else in this fucking place, it's ancient and broken. Web. <laughs> so what are we doing? We just gonna sit here and pretend to eat? Oh, I think I just pissed What's people the off. Plan, Charlie. The plan? In true lawn and entertainment fashion, we're going to sit with our thumbs in our asses until a panic deadline looms over us, and then we'll just throw some shit together, and I'll save it with a voiceover. Say it. Say it. Well, here's to Topeka. No longer being the worst decision Charlie has ever God, made. Everybody's such a dick. Everybody's so mean to Charlie. I know he's a dick, but... I'll be nice. Now, I would like to toast all of you. Really? Okay, I'll do that. I know that I'm the butt of your jokes. <laughs> and Trust me, they've been going off all night. The patriarch of our little family. Mark... And Jamie, the two of you do the work of a team of ten. And Kate, despite our bickering, you are the heart of this show. You keep people interested. And finally, to our newest recruit, Erin. I should have said we lost. You lost my cigarettes, you dick. Who else to remember every little thing? I mean, even though you did forget my cigarettes. Thank you all for your hard work. Cheers. Cheers. To us. Mazel tov. Huzzah. What we can get here can take the show to the next level. Sure. If we have time to get it all. Yeah, he totally heard us. Nah. No way he'd say all that nice shit if he heard us. Oopsie. Maybe we shouldn't talk about it right this second. You brought it up. <sighs> what was that, Kate? Nothing important, just spitballing some ideas. I think she'll look best if we can really make the backgrounds look as creepy as possible. Shouldn't be hard. Um, does anyone else think it's weird? Dumet hasn't showed up yet. Yeah, I don't Did think we already establish that he's gone? What do we want Were you to not listening? First? Charles, you're the boss. Thank you. I think it makes sense for us to start in the lobby. There's still decent light to work with, and it's symbolically where things will begin in the murder castle. With what light's already in there, we just need to set up a couple of our own. We can make it look as if it were lit by gaslight. Perfect. What if Dumet shows up? If he tells us to stop, I'm going to be having a strong word with him. He's put us in this position. All right, everyone grab what they need and we'll meet in the lobby. Hopefully that helps. Let's be as Let professional as possible Look from off. here on in, please. No mistakes. Perfection. If he comes back, I don't want him to see us fucking about or arguing. Good call. We're on it. Right, guys? Fantastic. I'd love to hear that. Shouldn't take me long at all. I thought we were missing somebody. Right. I thought there were like six of us. Great. Right. Great. Right. Everybody left their wine. <laughs> what the hell are you people doing? <laughs> I 
<gasps> oh god, he's already got all of us made. Alright, it's anybody's game at this point. No clue knowing who's gonna die. Sounds like somebody was having sex for a second. <laughs> Hang on, check the room. Just make sure I'm not missing anything. Okay, we might, we might be dying first. She's cool with that. Okay, I think it's back the other way. Damn it, this is my room. <laughs> Is this? Sounds like it's like right here. I would be the worst sound person ever. What's this hanging? Am I like terrible at this? <laughs> Did we go with the cheapest we could find tonight? Cheapest vodka? I went with the Costco brand. Is that is that cheap? The Kirkland vodka, that's what I went with. Okay, it's like right in here. I'm gonna spend the next like hour trying to figure out where the hell the sound is coming from. Air, how are you doing today? Oh, we died. She got stabbed in like a dark area, so she might be dying right now.
I like how she's like the scaredest one, but now she's like walking down this pitch black hall like hallway listening for sounds. Lame, she's gonna die. <laughs> well, I wouldn't go for anything like pop pop or, or anything like that. <laughs> or Bartons? Oh god. Tito's or Kirkland, I like. What's your go to kind? <gasps> oh, facts. Cheers, my friend. Thank you for the sub. Mm. It's been a while since I had a drink. Cheers, my friend. Air, I got through college on Barnes as well. I think that's like staple for college. Like you have to, you have to drink Barton's in college. <laughs> I think my senior year is when I um, upgraded to Absolute. Because we were feeling really bougie. Fax, how's your Tuesday going? Mr. and Mrs. Mark Edwards, this is 2011. As instructed by you, we've made the request amendment to your will. A uh, uh, codicil? What is that? Has been added, which states that the event of both your deaths, the sole beneficiary of your entire estate, is Mr. Richard Bell, Belknap. The recommended copy of this letter is given to your legal representative for the records. Please remember you can view the blah, 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 blah. Columbus Spa. Oh, oh, this is gonna be, that's gonna be code for something. Digital lock installation. Write this down, baby. Zero, four, five, one. We're gonna need that later. It's all right. Uh, it's going well. Today flew by. Now that I like look at the time. Holy shit! It's already nine forty. Um. But today went well. This week's like going by crazy. I don't know how somehow we're past. Um, Might be time to join the 21st century, guys. Somehow this week's been flying by, and somehow it's already end of May, which is wild. Oh, okay. <laughs> The jump scares are so bad tonight. <laughs> Max, there's been like a shit ton of jump scares in the game. Uh, that's your proper entrance though, right? Hello. <laughs> Cheers, friend. Oof, that one hurt. <laughs> I love your entrances, Fax. Never change. Ooh, there's... Stuff. Okay. Can't get into that one. Nope, didn't mean to do that. I'm guessing this too? Oh, that's new. Getting creative with Charlie's script. Don't care, don't care, saying out of that drama. 
We already looked at this, so I don't think this is anything new. Okay. You got the nice entrance, then the real one. <laughs> That's how I prefer it. So thank you. Vax, have you seen um, Man of Medan? You're not, this is not Man of Medan. I'm not going to be able to, to get that right. Have you seen this game yet? Um, the Devil in Me? It's part of the Dark Pictures anthology or whatever that thing is called. Oopsie. I guess I don't have to turn it on. Let's turn it back off. Since it didn't do anything, let's turn it back off. Back upstairs, perhaps? It said 178 earlier, so why did that change? Or it said 179 or something. October 22nd. Thank you for allowing me to contact you directly. Your publisher said that you were very keen to hear from me. It seems to have a mutual interest. I spent several years constructing an ultimate homes tourist experience by faithfully recreating the World's Fair Hotel. We have not yet opened to the public as there have been finishing touches. Um, I invite you to visit the hotel for the weekend. The experience is designed to accommodate groups of five guests. Why five? So I extend the invitation to our four, to four friends or family of your choosing. I must insist this invitation be kept confidential. Okay, so wait, who is this to? Is is Charlie's name last name Morello? No, to Joseph. Okay, who's Joseph? This must be the people that were going there before us. Well, what the shit? Oh, I have a flashlight. I'm a fucking idiot. I tried to turn that on. That's locked. What am I missing? That's locked. Yes. Oh, there's a whole other hallway back here. Okay. Enjoy your memorabilia, memorabilia, dude. Make better choices. This is your own damn fault. Wait, what? Who bought this? I'm assuming that the the guy that brought us here brought that. Mr. Pelton has requested the further renovations of the hotel spa. We're currently negotiating a formal contract. Um Cool. You haven't haven't the only game I've been concerned with is the new Zelda. Ooh, are you playing that? How are you liking it? Ooh, I have the code. Sorry, one second. Let me keep snooping to make sure I got it all. Oh, 
whoa, whoa. That was really creepy. <laughs> Going in the back of her head. Oh, this is that same room. Okay. Nope. How did I miss this? How did I miss that door? I just gotta make sure I get everything. Whoa. Oh, Jesus, another door to open? Go up there. Go up the stairs. Go. Just go behind the curtain. See what's, see what's back there. Okay. Main lobby. Got it. Alright. Let's go enter the code. Zero. Four. Five. One. Thank God. Something from this century. Okay, don't fuck this up, Whitney. Okay. Okay, I think we need to start at the, the bottom this time. I did this right. Yeah. Genius. Genius. One second. Right. I think we're calling it a night. So, let's go hang out with Ducky, who is playing Dead by Daylight. Uh, thank you guys so much for hanging out. This game is getting really, really fun. There's a shit ton of jump scares. So, it'll be very exciting to start it again on Thursday. Uh, so, like I said, if you want to hang out, we will go raid Ducky. Let me get that all ready to go. Let's see. Oh my goodness. Alrighty. Thank you so much again, friends. I appreciate you all hanging out. I had really a lot of fun tonight. Um, so hopefully I'll see you all Thursday. Have a good Wednesday. And I will see you later. Bye-bye, friends.